This episode is brought to you by That Gosh Darn Hippie Show, the grooviest thing on your radio. And by Black Butler, parody of the Phantom Hives, a Black Butler abridged series slash parody. Thank you. Nothing says medieval Paris like mid 19th century can can music. Welcome to Paris, to Paris in spring. Ah, the small world dolls have escaped and are running rampant. Hans, Franz, and Larry? On the right, it's Jane's dad from Tarzan. Well, adapted in the sense that we took the title and a couple of ideas, then filled the rest out with cartoon cliches and bad songs. Check out our Patreon and Kofi links. No thank you, I went before we left. We're only one minute in and already the costumes have gone through 15 different time periods. Yeesh, I've seen kaiju movies with better lip sync. Yeah, yeah, and you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Oh, just tell me those instruments aren't her dead family. No, not the key change. Oh, this is wee wee, all right. Hey, I didn't know Kandinsky did the Notre Dame Rose window. He's been doing this for the past 10 minutes to drown out that opening number. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. If I were a Good bell, that's what I'd go. You. Good morning to you. The bats are in the belfry. <laughs> <laughs> Someone pass a hot chocolate. Cool it, you dingbat. I hear something. <laughs> yeah, I guess you have to be a bat to get it. Pia! Where is Pia? <laughs> Gaston Lee Whiplash. You bellowed for me, monsieur? He's not dancing, he must stretch illegal. And can you explain Did why my I voice sounds like I'm shouting in a coffee a can? Duck? Wow. Uh oh. Well, you did. Have I not prohibited all forms of recreation and pleasure? Oh, that you have, monsieur. Did I not cancel the kitchen scraps for lepers and orphans, put an end to merciful beheadings, and call off Christmas? I am not keen of mind, but that gypsy woman's instruments, they seem to live. Wait, I thought Pink Boy here was one of... You know what, forget it, the less we think about the opening number, the better. But I know she has great beauty. My father's apparent will not accept such flagrant disobedience! <laughs> Another delightful comic turn from James Corden. If our citizens do not work, they will not pay us taxes. The GOP response to the COVID-19 epidemic. I must stop the gypsy sorceress immediately. I have a great Frenchy plan. Suddenly horses, don't sweet. Bia! Bia! Aw, I was listening to the generic Toreador music. Why do they all talk like Speedy Gonzales? Wait, this is our title character? Excuse me? Movie, I demand to speak to your manager. Who knew bats were such great ventriloquists? 
les couets pour les grands fromages. Ah, royalty-free <laughs> classical music, the true calling card of a Golden Films movie. <laughs> Out for his evening smug. <laughs> Look how they scatter before me, cowering cowards who tremble at mention of my name. No, they just don't want to be around it when Disney get sues you. Than this. Oh boy. Uh, did that happen, or did I just hallucinate it? In layman's terms, the fight is over, fellas. <laughs> oh, good to know this movie will have its quota of fat jokes. Soon the little gypsy witch will regret the day she entered my city. Watch how I handle her. Ahem, how you do it? She was pretty. Perhaps, but she is an unnecessary distraction for my people. Let's With her popular it, Instagram account. Base. And beauty is only skin deep, while a silver coin is worth its weight in gold. <laughs> Allo, it is very subtle at this point, but I'm the bad guy of the story. Shocking, I know. <laughs> Melody? We should Melody? Uh, flee! Uh, flee or fly, so we're free! Look, just don't get captured. I got a sweet gig getting slapped against that ass of yours. Hey, Clack. Yeah, Clack. Who's a big bully? Let's jump him. Yeah. Every single character in this is more oh, yeah. annoying than all of the Beauty and the Beast ghosts put together. Of course you're thrilled to meet me. You've often dreamed of this moment. Yeah, and but now is usually the point where I wake up imagine. screaming. Uh, I don't know what to say to such a statement. Certainly not. Words fail you. Uh, could you stop your instruments from staring at me? You They're creeping me out. Illegal. Singing is illegal. Doing anything against the law is illegal. And most of all, magic is illegal. Gala, where are we? Where are they? What's going on in this movie? Dames in distress. Where's Quasi? In punishment, you could be sentenced to 324 years behind bars. What do you want to bet he's in the for profit prison racket? <laughs> you... Lucky for you, I'm feeling charitable. Tonight you may savor a luscious dinner for two with none other than my own glorious self. Wow, well, well, that was fast. Know, no conflict between You're spiritual beliefs and carnal desires, no companion. inherent racism to the wrestle with. Just straight to the purving. changed considerably since my day. Imprisonment would be better than dinner with somebody as pompous and small-minded as yourself. Was that a yes? It did not sound like a typical yes. It was no yes. No? Yes. No! Yes! Third base! No! That's the yes. <laughs> Ungrateful riffraff! I refuse to do the time warp with you once more! Straps. As for you, mademoiselle, perhaps our friend the guillotine will remove your lovely but ill-mannered head from your shoulders! We'll just need to wait a few centuries to invent it. Look! <laughs> <laughs> Were they required to put a fat joke in every three minutes? Quickly, Mama! Quickly! This will get you to Bethlehem. I said you so Quasimodo is just a guy with bad posture and an awful How haircut. How does that make him different you from your average sixteen-year-old? Back to your bell tower, brute! She's getting away. I don't know. Anyone who forces those instruments on the world deserves some kind of civic on, punishment. Oh, okay, Clack. I'm right behind you. How dare that mere gypsy mock me? Me! I am not just anyone! I'm a conglomeration of multiple villain cliches! You're you, that's for sure. No doubt about it. You are as you said. You. Ah, the French philosophers are overrated. <laughs> The next time I see that girl, it will be the final day of her accursed life. I should be feeling something, what but I'm not sure father? what. This brie cheese, it's the most delicious I have tasted today. I am fat and I love food, get it? And there on the door handle was the hook. We're unwanted. 
Unwanted, yes, but never unheard or unseen. I'm tired of being an outcast. I'd like to be a UGK for a oh, while. It's been that way for as long as I can remember, and that's longer than I care to admit. What's the crime in dancing our dances and singing our songs? Just and spitballing here, it might go over better if you violin. lose the creepy instruments. Why does Captain John claude persecute us so? Eh, we evil gonna do what evil gonna do. Inside of us, so he fears us and loathes us. They don't like us because we're different. Are they the only people living in Paris? Oh, I don't suppose we might stop and rest for the night? I don't suppose so either. Yes. No. Yes. Oh. Indeed. We shall search all this night if we must. Of course. And this time, the creature Quasimodo will not save her. <laughs> Cream Camel. Camel. Chocolat. Yeesh, the evil sisters in the Beauty and the Beast cartoon were more developed than this guy. Hey, what's the fuck? Do you hear that, Pierre? It's your father, sir. Eating in his sleep again. No, no, that! Flamenco guitars, we must be getting close. <laughs> Why the fools I know Blonde Roma too. are a thing, Don't but this is still the whitest tribe I've ever seen. Someone didn't hang their food in the trees and it attracted bears! <laughs> Once more, you have the pleasure of my company! Let's go! Let's go! The cathedral, Melody! Hurry, he's coming now! Look out! Just give it a second, her two brain cells have to shout across her cranium to get each other's attention. I'm afraid these ancient legs aren't what they used to be. What legs? They are to Notre Dame. These are big steps. Boy, they sure She'd probably make steps. better time wow. if she Come lost on. the bickering instruments. Help! The door is heavy. Well, ring the doorbell. Maybe a member of the vestry can let you in. Ten to one, that door is marked push. Come on, put the put the portal into it, guys. You'll never get away, Moshelli. Your basic incompetence will be your downfall. Check it out, dingbats. There's a girl outside. She looks like she's in trouble. Well, let's let her in. Yeah. <laughs> now I know what they mean by that shit insane. Oh, look at that, a magic door. Quick, close So, me. I guess Notre Dame I has a ring Captain. installed? Never say never. Hey, there's some bad guys outside. Yeah, let's let them in too. Not. There is a lot of competition for most annoying comic relief Sacre in this movie. Bleu. She got away. Don't just open for anybody. They're picky. We can what, so now the doors are sentient? Never... Is there going to be a talking piscina in this? Well, well, look what the donkey dragged in. <laughs> Damn, lack of reaction if must run in her family. His old mother. Couldn't keep up with the others, could you? Francois hurt his knee. Well, time for Something the glue factory. Me, your precious daughter won't stay in the church long when she learns you're in trouble. Oh, she's Don't not my daughter. She daughter, just belongs madam. to the crazy she's hermit down the street. Notre Dame. Silence, Pierre. The only person in there is Quasimodo. Someone at Golden Films really scary. likes their Tchaikovsky. I told you, we do not speak of the monster. Really, sir? Your own brother. Half brother. Well, now to be yes. fair, is this John coincidence Trump's any more extraordinary than half the stuff Hugo came up with? With father. Air all my family secrets. Why not throw in my short size while you're at it? Thirty-five wide. Boxers are brief too, but after so many rich dinners. But anyway, her second husband, the Baron, got a lot of work out of Quasimodo before they banished him to the church. Never How does this guy know everybody's so life history? Anyway, does he curate a wiki on all these people? That's enough. It's all quite sad, really. Tell me about it. This is making Secret of the Hunchback look good. Who said that? Who was that, Click? I don't know, Click. Oh, it was probably a comical aspergillum or something. 
Me, my voice, is she's a much lower. Uh huh? Now, where and when are these guys in relationship to everyone else? And how do they manage to see and hear everything that's going on? Voices from nowhere. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Strong words. Hey, Click. Wonder if they got anything to eat up there. I don't know. Let's go see. Whee! Yeah, we got some great munchies up here. No, you, you guys like have those. the munchies. <laughs> oh, I love a little bratwurst with a little sauerkraut and a nice strudel for dessert. Mm. Mm, I love strudel. Never knew instruments had such voracious appetites. The that explains bells. why my lunch keeps They're disappearing so around beautiful. my flute case. Kind of noisy. Yeah, it could be a headache. I could listen all day. <laughs> instruments that bells. just play music and Can don't talk? I never knew such marvels exist. Sure, honey. Come on up. Up where? In the belfry, man. Where else? Well, your Here creepy, we mysterious right voices, so I trust now, you implicitly. On, Wait for me. Wait for me. We only have a little farther to go. How does someone who spends her life dancing and walking from place to place get so out of shape? My strings! Oh, they are a trembling! My bow! Oh, she is a breaking! Dude, I'm right here. I can speak for myself. Here I come! One! Check it out, guys! I'm a slinky on rewind! I'll make it to the top! And I'm the only one with hair! What? Bats? Where? Bats in the belfry, man. Where else? Oh, I hope you all get white nose. Duck! Duck? I thought it was bats. It's ducks, according to the accordion. Will someone please turn down the Benny Goodman? That violin, kind of high strung, isn't he? Yes, beat them to death. Look at that girl, batting bats. Don't mind us, honey. We're a bunch of thing bats. If Quasimodo is deaf in this version, then he wouldn't have to hear their jokes. He knocks. Quasimodo. He looks like Shaggy's ancestor. There he is. He looks like such a nice fellow. Please come out, monsieur. We climbed all this way to meet you. Go away. Okay, can Go. we just leave some literature? You don't want to see me. I'm ugly and horrible to look upon. Please. We don't care what you look like. No. I could never stand next to one as lovely as you. With your generic Stand Disney princess him, face. He's nothing to write home about. Huh? Anyone who makes such beautiful music can never be ugly. You Christine Daae would beg to differ. I know it. Go ahead, laugh! Oh, just get a posture pal and a haircut a and get over it! I'm sorry if I frightened you. We all look different from one another. It, it doesn't matter. Well, I suppose hanging out with all She's those right. instruments has inert her to horror. Again. Hey, you're kinda cute. I'm a freak. There is nowhere I belong. We love your music, Mr. Quasimodo, and we're equally fond of your looks. I mean, you've got that cute Veronica Lake thing going. I like that. I, m I made these for you. I made it out I of macaroni and ping pong seen. balls. Ah, oh, romance. There is a nothing like it. Yeah, and this is oh, nothing like it. Oh, what a couple of cutie pies. They're so sweet together. Uh -huh. Isn't love swell? Sure. What are these two? Siblings? Lovers? Do they have some kind of Lannister thing going on? Very sweet of you. <laughs> Everything comes to life around you, Melody. It's as if you were magical. Or cursed. <laughs> Suddenly I'm hungry for hostess snack cakes. Anybody else? Something interesting, and that something's a big surprise. I hear this kind of ringing every time I look in your eyes. Oh, a loving duet about tinnitus. It's a sound that I adore, so I'm just gonna look in your Wow, Quasimodo went from bitter recluse to suave dancing partner in a big hurry. When I'm looking at you, I'm so aware of a tingly jingle in the air, cause the 
The bells must be on mute. There's a ring a ding ding in in my ear. When I'm looking at you, it's simply great. I can hear the bells tintinnabulate. And whenever our eyes should chance to meet, ooh, dandruff. In my feet. The bells all ring whenever you're around. They no, I think that's a migraine. What a wonderful thing! It's my favorite sound. Do they have suction cups on their feet? When I'm looking at you, it's so sublime. I can feel the bells within me chime. Like the first draft of I Can Hear the Bells wasn't very good. There's a ring a ding ding in my head. When I'm looking at you, I hear a tone like the ringing of someone's telephone. Look, just because Shakespeare got away with anachronisms doesn't mean you can. The bells all ring whenever That glitter is going to get into everything. The Vermin Chorus approves. More on calling. Oh no, what is it, Francois? Oh, I didn't get the call back for Nestor. Taken mother. We Wait, why can't she her. make the donkey talk too? Does it only work oh, on instruments? Let's get out of here. Let's go, boys. It isn't safe for you to leave Notre Dame. I have to go. She's my mother. She needs me. Okay, here we go. Mamma mia, she's a long way down. Mamma mia, here I go again. My, my, how can I resist ya? Come on, let's go get him. <laughs> Oh, for the love of turn the handle! No, push! Pull! Push! Pull! Hey, man, like we gotta let them out! You know? Who put the jazz bats in charge of the door anyway? Whoa! Bye. Thank you for everything. We'll be back. Like before, we will fight the fight and win the war. Well, she made it a couple of miles without getting captured. I'm impressed. Let's go save her. Hop, boy. Hop. Who's driving this thing anyway? This is not the Can Melody's magic powers shut up the annoying instruments, or does it only work one way? Sensitive, but a Oh boy, sit down. Like this version of the Bremen Town musicians. What do you see, Francois? Is that it? Is that where they have mother? How should I know? All I know is that roof looks delicious. She's in a barn up ahead. Come on, let's go find out what's going on. Okay, there's only one early 19th century guard outside. I think I can take him. Um, what happened? Did the stock music budget run out? Some quarantine videos are better than others. Dance! Dance until you drop! Then into the stew with you! Golden Films Animal Farm Oh, nothing like a good farm orgy! I hope we're not too late. Oh, mio! What have they done to Signora Genevieve? Wait, that's who Guinevere was praying to? Mother? Mother, can you hear us? Sorry, we think the horse wore her out. Whoa! <laughs> oh, speak to me, my liebchen! Speak to me! Oh, oh, oh! Jeez, shut up! Up! This is the first time in months I slept without you bickering nearby! Mother, are you alright? Ah, it's you. Then we're all here. Let the party begin! It's a tough race, but I think we found the stupidest character in the movie. What are you nuts? We gotta get out of here! There's no time! Look! This hay, she's aggravating my allergies! Curse of the dark magic for giving me sinuses! 
Yeah, we gotta be quiet. Sneezing is definitely Kaputsky. Right, because all your yammering hasn't been enough to alert the guard, but a sneeze will definitely tip him off. Help Mama to the window. <laughs> Hold on to my ball, Belladonna. What? No, you just sneezed into that thing. At least wash for 20 seconds first. The guards had time to get reinforcements and treat them to a light lunch already. Does Mademoiselle need some assistance? Ow! Oh, let go of me! He may be evil, but I approve of his tough stance on annoying talking instruments. I need an iron for those wrinkled pleats. Well, she's taking this kidnapping very well. Say goodbye to your lovely daughter, old Kron. She's mine now. This is a very unorthodox adaptation of Il Trovatore. Yeah, look at her. She's totally a fiery free spirit. Bye. Well, maybe now we can get that Esmeralda girl into the story. I feel so full of the sadness. My heart, she is a crumbling. You don't have a heart, you just you have a resonating chamber and a bad Will Italian accent. Back? Where's your gypsy spirit? Excuse me, I think you mean Roma spirit? <laughs> don't worry, my little rosebud. You will not be in here long. No, no, you're doing it all wrong. You're supposed to lock her in a lavishly With appointed the tower the room. Strike dawn. It's execution time! <laughs> You're just really bad at this wooing and unwilling captive thing. Oh, poor mother. What will happen to her? Oh, don't I worry. I'm sure had. the talking instruments can find a nice assisted living community. <laughs> Guys, this is hard enough without you whimpering back there. Oh great, the rescue is going to hinge on the resourcefulness and cunning of sleigh bells. Quickly, to the Polar Express! Yeah, yeah, Riddy Pagliaccio. Oh, you'd think a relic such as myself would be better equipped to handle this. Actually, no, I is wouldn't. Is Mademoiselle Melody okay? Is she out? What have they done to Frau Melody? Where is my Melody? Gee, Click, do you know what they're saying? What do I look like, Duolingo? Oh, what are they saying? Um, ding dong, ding dong. Ah, gee, I thought you spoke bell. Oh, sure. Just because I'm a percussion instrument, I automatically know all percussion languages. When the cathedral bells strike, she is to be executed. Well, time to check to see if the cathedral has a snooze button. settles it. The morning bells won't ring. Yes, I'm sure the evil, joy-hating creep who is angry because he got turned down will absolutely cancel the execution if the matin stole doesn't go on as scheduled. ...and telling him not to ring them until Melody is a back with us. Yeah, let's go! So, Quasimodo's only influence on the climax will be whether or not he does his one job. I hope it is nice. I can't imagine a life without Melody. Ooh, this is kind of nice. I should get away from those bickering instruments more often. Christmas tree needs to be thrown out. Hey, I wandered over from the Beauty and the Beast set. I don't suppose you have cheeseburger, do you? Anytime you're in a lion den, forgotten and far apart. Doesn't have quite the same emotional impact as someday, does it? You can be with all your family. Hallucinations make captivity fun. And you'll be happy, snappy, and strong. Close the story that you live in. Oh, great, she's using her evil magic on the architecture now. Maybe she'll cause Notre Dame to rise up and crush her enemies. Put your faith in your imagination. How are they singing without lips? You know what? Never mind. The alternative is worse. Trouble seems funny when the magic is. 
Achoo! Sorry, allergies. Hey, how about turning them into a few strong men to break you out of there? Still, there's no Rebel Wilson scratching her crotch and devouring cockroach people, so it could be worse. Maybe Melody's real power is inventing jazz several centuries early. Unfortunately, she can't magic up a new animation sequence. You can win or take it on the chin. The trouble should come to pass. Bum 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 da da dum ba dum ba da 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 dum da dum da 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 dum. From your tower, you can find the power to create. You know, I think burning at the stake is too good for her. Aren't there a couple of neglected British children she should be teaching? Hey, the other prisoners have asked me to fast track your execution. And the cat turned back into a cat. Uh, gee, thanks, but I haven't eaten for three days. Can you magic some of those mice back? We gotta stop Quasimodo from hanging those bells. Come on, hurry up. One, two, one, two, one, two. Don't waste any time. Come on. Oh, I should have retired last year when I had the chance. What kind of pension plan do tambourines get nice anyway? Bookshelf somewhere. Etienne, I told you to leave the gimp mask at home. <laughs> ah, I was enjoying the quiet! Why did you have to cut back to those idiots? This shall be the dawn of a most lovely day. I love the smell of neck blood in the morning. Golden Films now concludes its broadcast day. Don't waste any time. Come on. One, two, one. Let's go. Don't worry about the me. For on the violin, I am a fittest of the fittest. And they're ready for love. Why, this is higher than I thought. Yeah. Come on, click. Okay, click. Pierre, did you deny Jesus again? Um, can we hurry this up? I got a brunch date. I don't want to know why that was in his pants. Best guy you could find for the job, huh? Say goodbye to everyone and everything you love. Ah, the GOP health plan. Look, mademoiselle, the sun is up. Daybreak has arrived. There is a bright golden haze on the meadow and the corn. She is as high as the eye of an elephant. Swear off your vile gypsy ways and I'll spare your life. Maybe we could even arrange a quiet dinner together. Well, I was fine with it until you threw in the dinner date. I cannot change who I am, monsieur. So proceed with your execution. The end of Hall of the Mountain King is stuck on replay. Don't bring those bells! Jump! Oh, so that's what all the shouting and clattering instruments in Overdramatic Orchestra was. I was curious. Mm, don't bother saying good morning. Shouldn't they be asleep by now? Hey, what's all that racket? Oh, don't touch that rope! Let go! Stop! No! Damn, forgot about daylight savings time. What is going on? Why won't the bells ring? Somebody wake up that hunchback immediately! John Crowd looks pretty angry. No, wait, was What's this supposed to be a hanging? Beheading? Does, Does she get a pick or do they flip a coin? Last night. Hey, you think I have time to run to the bathroom? I go on mid morning break soon. Can we get an ETA on the uh, bell ringing? Great, their executioner is Woody Allen. We are frozen in attitudes of surprise. Everyone stop screaming! Silence! Up this platform now! Back to your places! <laughs> Wait, am I a good guy or a bad guy? Uh, sorry. Mother was right, I should have gone into filmmaking. Excuse me, yeah, hi. Um, 
I don't know what to charge for execution canceled without the, you know, standard 24-hour notice. Did you buy the execution protection package? Want to play Heads Up 7-Up? Are you alright? What? Oh, the... Look so fuck. Handsome. You have beautiful No, eyes. excuse me. Sorry, this is the dumbest resolution to the Hunchback of Notre Dame humanly possible. It and yes, I am including odd. the one where he gets perhaps fucking angel wings at the so. end. Then perhaps I am. Mm -hmm. Just perhaps my looks really don't matter anymore. They don't matter. Perhaps we just pulled this ending out of our ass. Absolutely. Victor Hugo did not go into exile for 15 years and bang his way through the female population of Paris for you to disrespect we him like this. Celebrate. Let's have a party. Party, party. No, sorry, I'm social distancing. I have to keep at least six miles from all sentient instruments. So, wait, wait, did we just forget about Pseudo Gaston? Movie, hey, movie, you are not allowed to go into your finale until you tie up some plot threads here. Those are signs of generalized anxiety and depression. Talk to your doctor about solutions, including cognitive behavioral therapy and medication. Isn't a secret for everyone, by definition, not a secret? Shoot, they're still singing. Maybe I can go into Eclipse for a bit. With Pat Sajak and Vanna White. The women are all dressed like Cinderella cosplayers. Uh, ma'am, you gonna take our coats or what? Are they dancing or having an episode? Ah, yeah, I missed that butt action. So, we're really going with this for our ending, huh? I believe it was the wise sage Ransom Drysdale who said, and I quote, eat shit, eat shit, and definitely eat shit. Does that bow have a voice or personality of its own, or is it kind of like a vestigial twin? The mamas, the mamas, tradition! Did they contribute anything besides bad puns and jazz lingo? I think the animators gave up right about now and just started editing in as many previously used clips as they can. Wow, the Takara Zuka review finales have really come down in quality. It's not every day the background characters get animation, but the foreground characters don't. No, no, they're starting over! Whoa, premature finale. Now what it was to stand tall and look people in the eye. So the real deformity was get lack of self-confidence? I hate my this prisoner. movie so much. Melody's no longer your prisoner, and neither am I. You no longer frighten me, John Claude. You were frightened of that twit? No what, did you have anymore. a pathological phobia of handlebar mustaches? Yes, thank you so much for that clarification. Ah, he's no longer a hunchback. <laughs> The only thing I'm ashamed of is that you're my brother. You drank milk out of the carton and never replaced the toilet paper. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. Did you? All you care about is money. You force everyone to work hard and then steal their earnings. Oh, he's Jeff Bezos. You rob these people of their spirit. Lies. Lies. Fake you news. You and that sausage cooked this up. Yeah. 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 
couldn't get away with that. <laughs> yeah! Yes, that's just what this climax needs. More fat jokes. Clear the square! Get back to work! Don't make me wiggle my mustache at you! All they needed was one Stop mediocre white guy to teach them to stand up for themselves. Poor horse Get missed out on the here. part entangled by that much. Uh, bon appetit. I love food and I'm fat. It's really the only thing I've got. <laughs> Why is there a stained glass window of a geisha? Yeah, that's my reaction to all of this. Such a perfect couple. She's an angel. He's a prince. Oh, and I they don't have two brain cells to rub together today. between them. Instruments around here. We can... Wait a minute. We are musical instruments. Let's nope, play. sorry, you already blew the wad on the first finale. You don't get another one. What's all the noise? Why were we invited? Because nobody likes you. Vatican Dance Party. Um, ta-da! A little self-confidence and suddenly he's Barishnikov. There's no way their wedding night isn't going to involve some kind of talking monstrosity, is there? Hey, that's the it's Baron or whatever! Did he suddenly turn good and rise. stop eating his feelings? Oh, make a lovely family together? <laughs> um, no offense, but I was kind of imagining dying while cradling your broken corpse. I do love you, Melody. And I love you. Hey, they got cast in bronze to play their wedding. Maybe it'll settle down now. Have a family and quit ringing those darn bells. Oh, what a feeling when we're dancing on hey, the ceiling. What are you doing upside down. Uh, we're the ones that are upside down. Oh yeah, crazy. <laughs> Sorry, the good weed just kicked in. <laughs> yeah. It was a tough call, but I think this counts as the most annoying song in the movie. Something interesting, and that something's a big surprise. I hear this. Anthemson, isn't that the place where Elsa sang Show Yourself? It's a sound that makes me happy. Yeah, the screenplay it's was pretty rocky. So I'm just gonna look in your eyes again, and I'll get to hear it some more. When I'm looking at you, I'm so away. Liminoff, the new citrus infused vodka. Cause the moment I notice you up here, there's a ring a ding ding. When I'm looking at you, it's simply great. I can hear the bells tintinabulate. And whenever our eyes should chance to meet, there's a clanging, a clanging in my feet. A clanging in your feet? You should probably see a podiatrist for that. You're around. They ding dong ding. What a wonderful thing. It's my favorite Oh, I would sound. hate to be the guy who had to explain this stupid plot in Korean. When I'm Electric Zebra you, would be a so great name for a techno I group. The bells within me chime like the morning alarm beside my bed. There's a ring of it dinging in my head. When I'm looking at you, I hear a tone like the ringing of someone's telephone. Oh and God, what is the payroll cheat? When I'm looking at you, I hear a bell. The bells all ring whenever you're around. Color keys? I don't think there's a huge market for key coloring. What a bunch of ding-a-lings. Oh, shame on you, Diane. Have you no sense of decency? Sony Wonder, the shameful mockbuster arm of Sony Music Entertainment. Ah, 
Ah, there's the creepy letter con guy. I missed you guys at the beginning. G just walking in like, yeah, yeah, party don't start without me, boys. 